A lot of you like to tell me that I forgot the pedal bell, so this video will not end until I get the pedal bell! So people will finally stop saying that I forgot it. Right now, I'm on quest 25 out of 30 for Spirit Bear, so that means I'm gonna have to complete 5 more quests in order to actually get the pedal bell. Let's start off with the most time consuming thing, and donate a base kick to the Wind Shrine. Those rewards are a complete scam, but I don't really care. Next up, I just have to get a bunch of pollen. Guys, come! I have a server full of unpaid workers ready to help me. I hope you guys don't mind taking a few jelly beans. Can I please get some flowers? Hour? No, because this game hates me. And for this whole quest, I'm gonna be a blue hive, so this might be a little difficult to get pollen from white fields and red fields, but the one and only Yargs will get it done. And by the way, drop a like and sub if you want me to continue the series. Pollen and goo from sunflower is done. Moving on to clover. You know that clover times two fuel boost that I got earlier. Maybe it wasn't a complete scam. Clover is done. Now I have to get a billion pollen from coconut, but my crab's alive, so I have to kill this idiot first. Alright, well the crab is dead. Now we have to get a bit of pollen from here. Finally, the coconut pollen is done. There's only two things left to do. So yeah, first of all, let's feed 1,000 sunflower seeds to my slaves, I mean my bees. I don't feed them very often, so they probably deserve it. There we go. And to finish off this quest, I need these idiots here to take my beans. Oh, they're like little ants, just running around, collecting my food. Okay, my slaves. Only seven more beans. Take them, please! And the quest is complete. Oh my gosh. Okay, one down, four more to go. Technically five, because I still haven't turned this one in, but yeah, I missed a spear bear. Ants don't get a pass, really. Okay, spear bear. Oh, there there you are, dear. Yes, I'm a deer. It's official. Quest rewards are actually kind of mid, as always. Let's see what quest number 26 looks like. I hope it's not going to be too much suffering. Okay, memory match. Oh, I don't like this already. Okay, I better get some good stuff here. Okay, magic beans. Okay, you know what? I'm actually kind of dumb. This quest might actually take a few days because of getting pairs in memory match. 2,000 tokens from Sticknims? I just saw that, and I already hate it. Jelly, dice, glitter, treats, jelly. Oh, look, someone actually did nighttime. All I had to do is ask. All I really care about is a nighttime memory match. That's why I need a nighttime. Okay, I got two things from here. Not terrible. And the last memory match I can do is this one. I just hope I don't get scammed. Okay, extracts. Jelly. Star jelly. And lastly, a scam. Since I only got 12 pairs, I'm gonna have to come back to this in a few hours. But for now, let's just do the rest of this stuff on this quest. A thousand pineapples to Fuzzy Bee? Why not? And now that's done. Now we need a bit of that stick bug action. I just want to get through the most painful part of the quest first, which is collecting 2,000 tokens from sick nymphs. That's gonna be too much suffering for me. You know, maybe I was wrong. Maybe getting all these tokens won't be so bad, but we'll still probably take, like, two more stick bugs. Wait, I still haven't given the translator to stick bug? Alright, well, here you go. And how about, Mr. Stickbug, you spawn, and I can kill you, like, 29 more times. 500 tokens down, 1,500 more to go. Yeah, I'm only now realizing how long this is gonna take. Alright, my first stick bug is over. Almost got a thousand tokens from that. And right now I have a bronze shell amulet, and this one is a silver, but my bronze one is a little better. A thousand tokens down. A thousand to go. Okay, I got 1.5 thousand tokens from the sick nymphs. Once more, this amulet sucks complete balls. And we're almost done! Two more tokens, please! Yes! The tokens from sick nymphs are complete. Please, honey storm. That is all I care about. Getting the rest of the honey tokens might require a few honey storms. Actually, I should probably hold off on doing the honey storms. By the time I finish all this stuff here, the honey tokens will probably be done. So I might as well get straight to it. First of all, we can do pine tree, which shouldn't be too difficult. I literally get all my honey from pine tree. Oh, and look what I got here, the quest badge ace. That is so slay. All right, pine tree is almost done. Only a bit more pollen. Okay, now it's done. Let's go. Moving on to cactus. I might as well finish it because it's right here. I'm just wasting all my dice. Once more, a complete garbage amulet, but I don't care about that. I'm long past stick bug. All right, cactus is done. The last field I have to grind in a spider. Spider guys, come suffer with me. I'll be honest, blue hive isn't the best hive to do all this with, but I already spent so much time and money on this hive that I won't get rid of it for a while. First of all, I have to make like one quadrillion honey, maybe then I'll consider. Alright, so spider pollen is done, and I still need 1.5 billion white pollen, so I'll just keep grinding here for now. And white pollen is done too. Let's go. The only thing I'd love to do now is some honey tokens, and to match a few pairs in the memory match. The oils, I can waste right now, and I'm saying waste and not donate, because this is a complete waste, but it has to be done for the quest. Garbage rewards. And now I wait for 27 hours for the memory matches to refresh. Alright, so it's been a few hours, and everything is done except the memory matches, the stupid suffering idiot part of the quest. Alright, gumdrops here. Um, jelly right here. No, I'm freaking dumb. Jelly is right here. Oh my gosh. Okay, whatever. We got two things. Only 11 more to go. Okay, so micros. Some flower seeds. Jelly. Okay, so we can get the jellies here. Oil. And jelly. What about here? Coconuts. I got the coconuts. Oh my gosh. And some flower seeds. Some flower seeds are right here. Let's go, dude. We got four things from here. Or wait, did we get three? I cannot count. We got three. Eight more 
more to go. If I don't want to waste another 27 hours here, I'm literally gonna have to get eight things in the next two memory matches. Please be off cooldown. No! The stuff I do for these videos, I'm literally wasting my life savings going for the night memory match. And I'm not even sure if it's off cooldown. Oh, my second time and hopefully the last- Bro, I hate everything. While I wait though, I've saved up all this honey for a reason. To spend it. So let's buy a few trillion honey worth of treats. Okay, there we go. Three trillion worth of treats should be good. To level up a few bees to whatever level I have to. I think most of my bees are level 15, so let's do a few of them to level 16. And it's not even that expensive. Only costs like 100 billion to get one to level 16. Which the sum might be a lot, but to a trillionaire like me, it's practically nothing. And there we go. Every bee I have is now level 16. Let's just hope I didn't miss a bee. Because everyone in the comments is gonna be like, Yarks missed a bee, not level 16 hive, scam, okay, whatever. Alright, it's been a few hours, so let's see what I can get. Okay, Noah Sprout is here. Some Moon Charms here. And lastly, um, Glitter, okay, this is kinda a gamble. No, bro, I only got two things from here. That's kinda a scam. Back to this poor people memory match. Okay, Sprout here, and Jelly right here. Only got two things from here. Not bad, though. Four more things only. Bro, I have to say, I absolutely despise the memory matches. I hate it way more than donating, like, 29 things to the Wind Shrine, because it literally takes, like, 27 hours to complete. And lastly, the Extreme Memory Match. This better not be a scam, I swear. Okay, we got Jelly here. Alright, I know we got Enzymes here. Bro, I have to get so lucky here. Oh my god, Blue Extrax, I remember they're here. And lastly, I'll just do this spot. Tickets! Wait! I think tickets are here. Yes! Oh my gosh, I literally got four things for one army match. I'm just too smart, and I can turn in the first bear bear quest out of many. I mean, not really. This is a 26 quest that I completed, and this next quest is gonna be just as much suffering. Bear without despair. Well, you know what? I'm gonna be going through tremendous despair making this video. I already am. So yeah, 26 quests down, four more to go, including this one. And there's just so much garbage I have to do here that is gonna be super annoying. But let's get as much stuff as I can done as early as possible. First of all, let's use a moon amulet. That is a scam, but whatever. I needed to do it for the quest. And to help me with all the sprouts, I've enlisted the help of some slaves, I mean some friends. Yeah, all of these guys are gonna help me with the sprouts. Wasting all these resources while donating them to the Wind Shrine always pains me tremendously. But you gotta do what you gotta do to complete these stupid quests. And we got a gummy sprout first try, bro, what? I really need all these gumdrop tokens. Gumdrop tokens are gonna be another really annoying thing, but if I get like two or three gummy sprouts, it shouldn't be that bad. So I'm gonna suffer for like half an hour and let people give me free sprouts. I'll see you when I'm done. I hope this doesn't take too long. Luckily for me, the tokens tokens from sprouts are done, but I'm not gonna tell these guys that. I'm just gonna say, guys, I need 10k more tokens from sprouts. Keep spamming. Yeah, I definitely need that much. And I got the 1 billion pollen from some field. Moving on to pineapple now. Maybe I can get pineapple from here. Yes, let's go. I actually got it. Wow, I didn't get scammered. Pineapple pollen is done too, but I still need a bunch of gumdrop tokens. Okay, let's go. This guy spawned a gummy sprout. Now I just have to get all the gumdrops. I'm not really sure what's going on. All I know is, it's a lot of sprouts. Alright, that's enough sprouts for now. Still gotta donate a thousand strawberries to my bees. Or I shouldn't say donate. I should say I still have to waste 1,000 strawberries, which is what I'm doing. There we go. Okay, finally I got done some tokens. What? That literally took like half an hour. Next, we gotta do some strawberry pollen. And goo from red flowers. I guess I can do both at the same time. Alright, bro. I've been grinding this for too long. Goo from red flowers is almost done. I mean, it's not almost done. It's literally done. Let's go. Same with strawberry pollen. Only a little more to go. Alright, nice. I got that. So now the only thing left to do is wealth clock and white pollen. That means I have to go back to the off-camera grinder. See, I'll see you guys in like three to five business days. This is the off-camera grinder right next to the Christmas tree. The off-camera grinder is working on its own. All right, it's the next day. Obviously, I used the wolf clock five times because beer without this bear can now be turned in. Bear, bear, do you want to make me suffer again? Of course you do because I want that stupid pedal belt. All right, there we go. Quest number 27 is done. Moving on to quest number 28. Even more suffering for me. Ah, oh, when will this end? You know, if people didn't tell me that I kept forgetting the pedal belt, I wouldn't have to do this. All right, so this looks like complete pain. Quest number 28. Okay, first things first, let's do some eggs to the wind shrine. Let's do a gold egg first. There we go. And I got a few good wins. Nothing too crazy though. Some other stuff I can do right now. Wasting more sunflower seeds by donating them to my bees. Now that's done. And I did get all these wins from donating the gold egg to the wind shrine, so I might as well put them to good use and get the pollen part of this quest done right now. And I also have to catch a bunch of coconuts, which hopefully won't be that difficult.
difficult. I'm just gonna put my 500 coconuts in the seventh slot. And I guess a coconut will bonk me on the head every 10 seconds. And, uh, guys, I made good financial decisions. I need this for, I need this for grinding. Pumpkin is done. Now we move on to Rosefield. That seems like so much fun. I'm being sarcastic. This is gonna be extremely painful. Since I'm a blue hive, white isn't too terrible to get pollen from, but red, yeah, this is gonna be so much pain. It's insane. Oh, wait, I just realized. I got the pollen from Pumpkin, but I didn't get the goo from Pumpkin. That's kind of a scam, but whatever. I might as well do it now while I have the Pumpkin ones and the field boost. All right, that's done. Oh, and I got this idiot here to join on his Fuzzy Balls account. Yeah, this hive has a little too many Fuzzy Bees, but that's a good thing because now all these flowers are gonna be super thick, just like your sister. Oh my gosh. Rose Field is done after literally like half an hour of grinding. Ah, oh, that was too much pain. I don't even want to imagine what mushroom will be like. I'll probably just find like a six-year-old off the street to grind mushroom for me and I'll pay him two cents per hour. Oh, look what we have here in this quest. Collect five oil tokens. Oh, fresh victims from which I can steal their life savings. Oh, this is just amazing. Let's just hope I can get five oil tokens as soon as possible so these people have to waste as little of their life savings as possible. Oh, there's one. Three oils. Four oil tokens. As Vitamin would say, this is kind of crazy. Easy. Another legendary sprout. Please give me like a diamond egg or an oil. There's an oil! And this guy didn't steal from me. So the oils are done. Okay, guys. Wait, this guy did another legendary sprout. I'm not gonna tell him to stop just yet. I still need 500k tokens from sprouts. Just so they know. Dang. I know, dude. Dang. That's gonna take so long. My 500,000 tokens from sprouts. You know, I feel like every quest I complete, I just end up buying more treats. So let's do exactly that. Three more trillion honey worth of treats. Going straight down the dumpster to my bees. I hope this is entertaining content, me gifting all my bees. That one was only level 15, but whatever. Now time to get all my bees to level 17. I think it costs like 370 billion to get one bee to level 17, which isn't a crazy amount, but it ain't cheap. There's another level 15 cringe, although I should probably focus on leveling up more of my event bees. Oh, just kidding. I'm poor now. Yeah, Eric, you're the reason I started playing BSS. If you're watching this video, bro, I'm sorry that I got you back into beast form. The only reason that guy is suffering is because of me. And another Buckleby quest is done. I'm not sure how many I've done, but sure it's a lot, right? Okay, let's check. 145, dude. So I'm only like 105 quests away from getting the Tide Popper. And when I get the Tide Popper, I'm gonna poke that people that don't like and subscribe straight in the ball. All right, this silly suffering quest is done. One down, 104 to go. I'm just kidding. This video isn't about Buckleby quests. Although Buckleby and Spirit Bear isn't much different. Both of them decide to scam me. Spirit Bear gives me all this stuff, which is pretty much impossible to complete. And Buckleby gives me the only quest that takes an hour to complete. Maybe I should move on to Riley B side and betray Bucko. You know what? I'm not gonna do that just yet. First, I have to get the pedal belt because obviously I forgot it. I'm just gonna go back to the off camera grinder. All right, it's been like two hours. Two hours of straight suffering and nothing else. Let's donate 1.5 thousand strawberries to the one shrine. Mushroom fields. I didn't even get any wins. I just got some magic beans and the star jelly. That will not make up for how traumatic this quest is. I think the best thing for me to do now, since I got mushroom times three, nice, is just to suffer all the way through this quest. White pollen I can get the easiest while grinding in something like pine tree. My mushroom pollen. Yeah, I'm not gonna escape how much suffering this is gonna be. See, let's pop a glitter, purple potion, all of this garbage. But I hope getting all this mushroom pollen won't take too long. Okay, you know what? Once you have time for a fuel boost and extremely thick flowers, getting all this pollen isn't even that bad. I mean, it's still incredibly painful getting all this, but I can manage. Oh my freaking gosh, mushroom is done after literally like 29 hours. I also got a bunch of white pollen done. All right, well, I did the mushroom grinding. Not really much more I can do except wait and donate to the one shrine again in like half an hour. See you then. I'm back again donating away my life savings. There goes another silver egg. I guess I have to wait another hour. Beast Worm is just a waiting game after all. My last basic egg to the one shrine. Only a few things left to do. Mostly I just need some white pollen. So let's hop in pumpkin and do some off-camera grinding. Also known as off-camera suffering because that's the only thing I do when playing this game. Suffer. It's almost done, boys. I got all the inspire. Only a bit more white pollen. Oh. <sighs> This quest has been making me suffer for too long. And I'm honestly scared for what the next quest will bring. Okay, Spirit Spree is done. Quest number 28 out of 30. Let's see what I get for completing the 28th quest. Mrs. Spear Bear, do not freaking scam me. I was about to say a bad word. Okay, as always, nothing too good, but whatever. What is quest number 29 gonna be? Only two more, boys. Spear Bear, please. Oh, memory match. No, match 25 bears. I don't wanna do that. Okay, I'm gonna have to be smart. Glitter? No. Scam? 
jelly. Um, okay, we got jelly here. Some flower seeds here. Only got two purse from this kind of scam. I guess now let's do all the memory matches. Yo, let's go three things from here. All right, the poor people memory match. No, man, moon charms right here. No, wait, is this jelly? I low key forgot. Yes, okay, jelly. And lastly, I didn't get the gumdrops. Scam. All right, gumdrops here and jelly right here. Nice. Lastly, oh, we got coconuts here. Let's go three pairs. And lastly, because I'm impatient, back to wasting my night bells to do the night memory match. You know, the reason I'm doing all this is because it would be super freaking annoying if I got everything done except the memory matches and I had to wait for like 27 hours for them to refresh. All right, please don't fall into the void. That would be utterly painful. No, that was super close. What? Okay, glitter here. Dice right here. Moon charm seer. Oh my gosh. And lastly, star jelly. That's a scam. Oh, I almost got it. What? All right, 13 out of 25. Not terrible. All right, so let's see what I can do right freaking now. First of all, I have to use 20 fuel dice, so let's waste those right now. Obviously, there is so many fuel stops to get pollen from, including pepper. Wow, yeah, pepper is going to be really painful. But the rest of them are blue fields, so it shouldn't be that bad. Now, I also have to do some tropical drinks and some glues to the wind shrine. Another massive waste. But Onnet wills me to do this, so there we go. 25 tropical drinks to the wind shrine. And these rewards are mediocre, as to be expected. A lot more wasting going straight to my bees. They want me to donate 1,000 blueberries. But you know what? I still need to gift a few of my bees, so let's just do until gifted. Wow, 13,000. Not terrible. And that part of the quest is done. Another one of my unpaid workers coming here to give me some sprouts because I'm way too cheap to waste my own. Oh, one extract token. Bro, I've been doing this for like 20 minutes and these people have probably wasted like 100 sprouts on me and that's literally the first extract token I've gotten. Wait, is that another one? Just kidding. No, it's not. I got my hopes up for no reason. Another one! Let's go. Two out of five. Why do I get a silver egg before I get red extracts? This is actually a scam. I'm not even kidding. I have officially given up on red extracts after a good 1,000 sprouts. Maybe it hasn't been that much, but whatever. It sure does feel like a thousand. So I'm just gonna go for blue extracts instead and hope I have some better luck. Another silver egg, but absolutely no blue extract tokens. All right, wait, my king beetle's alive. Maybe I can get blue extracts and red extracts from here. Please. I'm begging you, king beetle. Give me something. All right, let's just see. Okay, a red extract and one blue extract. That makes life a little easier. Bro, yet another silver egg. I'm about to get a diamond egg before I get a blue extract token. I'm getting oils, but I'm not getting extracts. Dude, what the heck is this luck? This guy literally did epic, epic, and uh, legendary at night. Extract token please i'm begging you if i get one i'll be happy dude i don't understand why are we getting legendary sprouts but i'm not getting blue extracts please i swear i need blue extracts here i'm begging you game wait i got one somehow some way yo i got three extract tokens now Another legendary sprout! Sorry, that's just me getting excited, gang. Yo, another one! Yes! Four out of five! Oh my gosh! Please, five out of five. Be it. Don't scammer me. This is absolutely crazy. I love what is going on. I love this game so much. This game is not scamming me. Anna, please release me from your basement. Yo, it's done! Yes! I should be a little quieter. Yeah, sorry, mom. Sorry, grandma. <laughs> sorry, I woke you up. I, I just got a little too excited. Yo, guys, stop. Go to Pepper now. I need your red extract tokens. Another legendary sprout. More suffering for me. This better give me at least two red extract tokens. Please. I'm literally begging you on it. I swear. You oh, there's one. Yes, one more. Please. What? Another legendary sprout. Why are we getting this many? I do not deserve this many, but hey, it's not my sprout, so whatever. Yeah! I mean, yes, let's go, guys. That was actually so pog. I finally got all of them. Yo, guys, stop wasting your life saving. Thank you so much. I want to do bad things. I want to do terrible things now. This has made me lose too much sanity. And this guy did another legendary sprout. You know, I don't even care. Screw this game. I'm hopping on tomorrow. All right, so, guys, I have a little surprise when I open this quest log. There we go. The echoing call is done. So, Spirit Bear, I'm hoping this is the last time I'm ever going to talk to you. So, this is quest 29 out of 30 completed. And the next quest will be the last quest I'll ever do for Spirit Bear. There we go. The rewards are getting better and better. And I have way too many micros. Spirit Bear, give me your quest for the Spirit Petal so I can get the Spirit Belt or the Petal Belt. I'm, you can already tell I'm going crazy because of this. It literally took me like four days to do this. So like and sub if you haven't already. Anyway, let's open the quest. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's actually not even that much. There's not that many things to do in this quest. However, everything I have to do is incredibly stupidly impossible. I mean, not really. Well, the 
the first thing I can do is donate some cloud vials. I have to do 50 total, but for now I can just donate 29. So Windy B didn't respond to me, just like my dad. That is a hecking lot of treats, what? All right, well, anyway, I don't really care. All right, so I'm back with my unpaid worker friend, and we're gonna do a bunch of sprouts so I can get those jelly tokens. And I just got a gummy sprout that is not gonna give me royal jelly tokens. The one thing that I don't need. This shouldn't be as terribly difficult as something like the red or blue extracts. Dude, that was actually such pain, I'm telling you. That was the most difficult thing I've ever done. I feel like an early game noob, where the only thing I'm trying to go for is the jelly. I already got 10. Yeah, this shouldn't be too terribly difficult. 30 tokens. I guess we're taking a little break because there's like 29 windy bees! What? I don't know why this is happening. What is Onnit doing? Is this Onnit trolling us? Or is this a sign from Onnit that he wants to help me because I need so many tokens from Windy B? I literally need a thousand, bro. That is gonna take so long. Bro, stop! I'm getting blown by Windy B! Wait, I didn't mean it like that, guys. Go on. <laughs> What is Windy B doing with me, bro? See, so yeah, from killing two Windy Bees, I only got 39 tokens. So that means I'm gonna have to do that like 60 more times. But for now, let's resume the sprouts, which also means resuming the suffering. And this guy's tornado is taking all of the jelly tokens. Wow, what a scammer. Even though he's giving me like half the sprouts, he's still scamming me by taking my jelly. Smart property. 50, 60, 70. And who is this kid, bro? How did this dude even join? Oh, wait, that's my friend. 80, 90. And it's done. 100 jelly tokens. Okay. Thanks for the scam, bro. More helpless people will give me their life savings. All right, we got our first Windy Bee. Usually when I do stuff like this, I would say, I really hope this doesn't take that long. But I know it's gonna take forever, so even hoping that it won't take long is not gonna do anything. Although I'm getting quite a few tokens, dude, and Windy Bee isn't blowing me for once. Wait, it's sus. I should stop saying that, right? honestly. I never learn. And this is pretty much multitasking, because while I need to get a thousand tokens from Wild Windy Bee, I also have to donate a bunch of cloud vials, which I once more have to get from Wild Windy Bee. So we're pretty much killing two birds with one stone, or should I say killing two bees with one stone? We've all had this moment where Windy B goes to coconut and your coconut crab is alive! A small interference and I'm dead. What a scam. How do I survive getting on this loot? I'm not sure. Oh, token link. And, um, and I'm not dead somehow. Okay, whatever. The first one to be of my unpaid workers is done. And I got 139 tokens total. So I'll have to do a lot more of that. Yet another windy bee. Bro, I'm literally diving. Stop. I'm just thanking this guy for taking my beans. And windy bee wants to blow me away. Windy 2 is done. And we're up to 230 tokens. Um, okay. And coconut crab is now officially invisible. Like my dad who went to get milk. Again. He never seems to come back with it. But yeah, we love bee game, don't we? Invisible coconut crabs, probably invisible attacks too. Most functional game on Roblox, by the way. And I'm literally taking damage from an invisible creature. Oh, my sanity has depleted to 25%. I still have 25%, which is enough to finish this quest, hopefully. Another one to be is done, and we're up to 330. 430? You know, me and these guys got the routine down. I kill the windy bee, I get the loot, and I throw some beans down, which they will collect. It's an unbeatable strategy. Bruh, some more cloud vials. And yeah, this windy bee is pretty much done. Up to 550 tokens. Halfway there, 609 tokens, 700 tokens. All right, boys, I'm not sure if this will be enough. Is this enough tokens? Yes, let's go! I got 1,000 tokens from Wild Windy Bee. That is such a difficult thing to do. I literally have to beg like 29 million people to spawn Windy Bee for me. And I also have 420 jelly beans shared. So I guess Pierre Pierre is forcing me to feed my slaves. I mean, my friends. So here you go, guys. Enjoy the jelly beans. And now that Windy Bee's done, there's a few other things that take priority, such as killing the crab and grinding coconut. So yeah, let's kill the crab first. That's more important. All right, so the crab is dead. Let's go. And now I'm gonna do as much grinding as I can inside of coconut. Like, I preferably want to finish it in less than 15 minutes. So let's get started on the suffering. So I can also glitter this up and use some fuel dice and hopefully get coconut times three. Fuel dice, please don't scam me too much. So like I said before, doing coconut right now, I'm killing three bees with one stone. I'm getting white pollen, I'm getting coconut, and lastly, I'm getting goop from white flowers. Speaking of which, I should really use some sticky gumdrops that I have. And my blue hive is surprisingly really good for white flowers because I am getting like 15 million pollen per second. You wouldn't expect that from a normal blue hive, but you know what they say. I'm like the best blue hive out there. No one's ever said that. I don't know who they are. I'm just making stuff up. All right, I'm gonna stop yapping. Jelly bean tokens are done. And coconut fuel is done too. You know, I'm just gonna lay off the white pollen for now and focus on more important things. Like, for example, um, I guess there's some field mountaintop and dandelion. Yo, is my sub snail dead? Please tell me it's dead. It is not dead. It's not even close to dying. That's gonna be a lot of suffering. I guess for now I can finish dandelion. We're bringing in my long lost friend, Mr. Fuzzy Man. You know, dandelion shouldn't even 
shouldn't be that terrible either if I just use some loaded dice. And Ana doesn't scam me. Okay, that's a scam. That is not a scam. Then this should all be really simple. We can actually use purple potion, tropical drink, all this garbage for all this really good stuff. I don't know why I keep calling it garbage. This game just makes me mad. That's why. You know, I might even get the white pollen done here because Sandline is just such a poggerous field. It's just too slay. What can I say? It's too slay. I'm rich like Lotte making this honey. I feel like a bunny. <laughs> I don't I don't know what I'm saying. I should just I should get back to grinding. Yark's on the beat. Dandelion is done. But I still have to finish the white pollen. And white pollen is done too. Okay, Dandelion took a little longer than expected. Almost like 30 minutes. But we're making really good progress on this quest. And I have a feeling I'm gonna finish it really, really soon. We got 10 more cloud vials going straight to the wind shrine. Windy Bee does not respond again. Big surprise. And I just need one more cloud vial to donate. I got the one cloud vial that I actually need. So I literally you only need to donate one more, and beside that one stupid vial, two more things are left. Mountaintop and Stump. Now I'm thinking I finish off Top Field first. No specific reason why. I just want to suffer in Top Field first. And Top Field is done. You know, I'm gonna go outside for a few minutes. I know it's crazy. Beast Storm player goes outside for the first time ever. It's like 2 a.m. And I'll see you really, really soon. Alright, so the off-camera grinder killed the stump snail. And I guess this is my first time killing it, so let's replace. OP amulet, by the way. So I'm not sure if you guys saw, but some field pollen is also really close to being done. And I'm literally a blue hive, so it should be really simple to finish. But before I finish some field, I have to make a small donation of one cloud file to Onnit or to the wind shrine. But same thing, because all these resources are probably going in Onnit's bank account. Because he's a little scammer, but whatever. Cloud file 321. Windy Bee doesn't respond. I'm not surprised. And it's time to go to some field and suffer for the very last time. This is your final chance to tell me in the comments that Yarx, you forgot the pedal belt. After this, nobody, and I mean it, literally nobody has the right to tell me I forgot the pedal belt. So enjoy your last chance to tell me in the comments that I forgot the pedal belt. Oh my gosh, nerd emoji. Uh, already making 29 billion pollen per second. This should be done really, really soon. I think this literally took him like five days worth of grinding to do so make sure you drop like and subscribe if you enjoyed the process of gambling i mean the grinding same thing because grinding is sort of like gambling because you're gambling away your sanity hoping to get better items okay i'm done with my ted talk enjoy the gambling or the grinding whatever you want to call it and like and sub for my sanity it's official less than 1 billion pollen left i'm getting so much pollen and i love it 500 million left 400 200 100 and boys i think it's time that I don't forget the battle belt! Yawn. I said, take it outside. The pouch for honey, just honey. Oh, there you are, dear. Thanks for noticing me, Spirit Bear. My dad clearly doesn't. She digs for the spirit petal in her bag. I've been giving these out for many ages, but I still have so many. There will never be enough of you beekeepers. I'll always be looking for more. There you go. Goodbye, dear. Oh, well, I apologize. I do suppose if there were ever a time to give a speech, now would be the time. Just go back to sleep, you the old fool. Yeah, you're right. Spirit Bear fell back asleep, and I got my spirit petal. Now, I literally have not checked once whether I have enough resources to craft this stupid thing. So, moment of truth. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, I can get it. Three, two, one. I didn't forget the battle belt! Now, I mean it this time. If you comment that I forgot it, I'm gonna nuke your house. I'm not even kidding. I have a few intercontinental ballistic missiles locked away in my garage, so comment at your own risk. But yeah, the battle belt has finally been acquired. And as always, more gambling on treats. One, two, that should be enough for now. Two trillion honey more worth of treats. I guess I can finish leveling up the rest of my vampies. Oh wait, Vicious Bee, why is it level 17? Everyone knows Vicious Bee needs to be 29 levels higher than every other bee. But I'm a little too poor to get him to level 18, so... I guess these cringe noob of empies will have to get the treats. A few point bees, and I'm officially poor. I literally have the economy of Zimbabwe right now. So yeah, like I said, this video literally took like 5 days to make. And also, shout out to editor man himself, no edits. You know, he's slaving away making these videos for me for minimum wage, so shout out to you, bro. And thank you for suffering for all of our entertainment. And yeah, if you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. And if you want me to pay my editors more... Also drop a like and subscribe, even though I probably won't. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, which is going to be season 2 episode 8. Bro, the season is flying by so fast. But yeah, thanks for suffering along with me.